Hi everyone, it's Gary Nicholson here for weatherweb.net. It's the fast forecast for your next few days. And the start of the heat building then through into Tuesday. High pressure away towards the east. We've got the flow coming in from the south-southeast. Quite a breeze across many areas, particularly around some coastal spots during the course of Tuesday. Quite a warm and humid feel though for many areas. A good deal of sunshine around though uh, throughout Tuesday. Always more in the way of cloud and some mist around some of these western coasts and maybe just enough to produce a spot of drizzle around western Scotland. One or two showers may just break out into the afternoon across the North Pennines into the south of Scotland, moving into southeast Scotland in the afternoon. But very, very hit and miss and very difficult to get the exact details of this one. The temperatures on Tuesday at around 29 Celsius in the south of England, around 26, 27 across the Midlands and the north. A bit further north into Scotland, your highs around 23 or 24, and similar values across Northern Ireland as well. A bit cooler in the far northwest of Scotland. Just compare those temperatures though with Wednesday, with your highs across the south and the east around 31, possibly even 32 in these areas, and highs of 30 Celsius extending well across the Midlands into northern parts of England as well. Around 27, 28 for northern parts of Wales, perhaps northwest England, and highs are around 26 for the south of Scotland, nearer to 23 or 24 the further north you go. But with that heat and the humidity comes the risk of some thunderstorms as well. The risk across these western regions is most greatest during the day on Wednesday, and then later on perhaps across the east as well. Quite a strong breeze from the south southeast, so don't be surprised to see quite a windy day across many of these eastern counties despite that very warm air. Just looking at Wednesday's detail, it looks as though there's some storms in the southwest across Wales as well at first thing in the morning. These continue to push their way further northwards into northern England across the northwest into Scotland by the afternoon and continue to rumble on into the evening and night. One or two may break out across the south and even the east of England later on as well. Now most of the storms clear by Thursday, but one or two may affect the far southeast. Temperatures here around 27, 28. Elsewhere highs around 25 or 26 and most places then drier and brighter and a bit less humid by Thursday. Some pretty warm nights going forward as well. Temperatures in towns and cities not dropping too much below 20 Celsius, so some uncomfortably warm and humid nights ahead. And that's the fast forecast. Thank you for watching and bye for now.